Hello everyone, this is Sikandar and welcome back to yet another video. Before starting this video, I would like to say I am using Filmora since 2 years. The things which I was missing, not I, every Filmora user, that is motion tracking and keyframing. Now Filmora come up with an upgrade, that is Filmora 10. Let's start the video. This intro is made by Filmora 10. If you like it, then comment down below. As you can see, Filmora added more than 15 features in Filmora 10. Now I'm going to tell you some highlighted feature of Filmora 10. Let me open the software. This feature allows you to track any object. Here I'm taking a clip of girl, where I will try to track her eyes. Now I'm adding one tag so that I can use it for tracking. After that click on motion tracking and make sure that object should not go out from the frame. Second step is to ensure that there should be a good tracking object. For that I am targeting her eyes which has good contrast. As you can see, Tex is tracking to her beautiful eyes. This feature can be used to make an intro video or when you have a still clip and you want some movement on it, then you can use it. Here I am taking two examples, one with image and one with video. First I will animate the logo. Here you can rotate or increase or decrease the scale. Then you can also adjust the position and also you can increase or decrease the opacity of videos. As you can see video is still, so I am adding some moment on it. When you have two or more clip of different light and you want to color grade, then it will take lots of time to color grade that project. But by using this feature, you can do it in a second by just taking one clip as a reference.
This feature is especially for YouTubers, those who use music on their voiceover. Earlier we were adjusting voice clip by clip or you can say frame by frame which was taking long time to do it but using this feature we can do it in a second. This feature is for those who want to edit their video fast using shortcut key. Here you get shortcut key for every tools which make easier and faster to every editor. And also you get option to customize your shortcut key. Last but not the least, most useful feature to every editor who use a software to record their screen or software to record their voiceover. In this you get three options. First is to record from your webcam. Second you can record your screen and third you can record your voice. So you does not require any third party software to record your voice or screen. This is all about highlighted feature. There are many more feature which I will tell you in upcoming videos. So from next video there will be tutorial of Filmora 10. There will be a short video of 5 to 10 minutes like my previous videos so that if you forget any effect or feature in future then you can just come to my channel and watch it. Thank you for watching this video and stay tuned for upcoming videos.